What's up everybody? I'm Luke with Ride Bikes More and today I am out in Las Vegas, Nevada with Eric for a bike ride interview. But before I get started, remember our goal, our mission is to raise bicycle awareness one person at a time to let people out there know that there are cyclists out there all the time to be careful with the cyclists and if you're not already remember to follow because it makes you feel good uh, this is eric i was riding around this morning and i saw him pass by with this awesome bike that he got over here so i had to say what's up eric tell us a little bit about your cycling background well my cycling background Luke, goes all the way back to the 80s um I always liked it bicycles. I was into skateboarding and all that too, but I always found bicycles to be my passion. What what kind of bike did you ride as a kid? Or in the 80s? Back in the 80s, they weren't as expensive as they are now, but we're talking low riders. Oh, low riders, nice. Low riders. And right now, what are you riding over here? Oh, right now, this is a little something I put together. You see, Luke, what I do is I take a bicycle, any bicycle, and I remember that old show, Pimp My Ride? Okay, that is what I do with bicycles. You pimp your bicycle. I pimp my bicycle, okay? I pimp my bicycle, anybody's bicycle. I like to call myself an artist, and bicycles are my canvas. Nice. And so, you know, as a kid, I was doing that for the kids in the neighborhood. And then as a grown adult, on and off, because we do have to make a living, you know, the work thing. Well, the plate is the BC Clater Company, LLC. I decided to take my art and turn it into a business. So I went ahead and got an LLC. I'm new. I'm starting, you know. Go fund me. But other than that. That's the reason for the emblem. And the name BC Clater, trademark, and you know, I got the, what do you call that on the internet? Uh, domain name. Yeah, the dot com. The dot com, domain name, right? Okay, so people can so, find you on, on the web. Right. And I needed a name that was kind of different. So I heard somebody say, How do you say bicycle in Spanish? And they said BC Clater. I thought, hey, man, that sounds pretty cool. So, I took that BC Clater, so no matter what, and made it into like the English form, BC Clater. So when you say the name BC Clater, you are literally saying bicycle. In Spanish. Right, in Spanish. Now, the reason why I went, and this is, I put this together in no time. The reason, and I know we're here to talk uh, bicycles, but I'll make it quick. Look, America is divided. We need a little bit more patriotism, and I'll leave that alone. That's the reason why, you know. We're all patriots, we're all Americans. We need to stay together. And if BC Clayta and Eric McBride can help, so be it. I can stand behind that message, Eric. I stand behind your message too. Thank you. Because when it comes to cycling here in Las Vegas, well, I'll be honest, we got plenty of bike paths, but we need more. It's very dangerous for our cyclists out here. Yes, I agree. It's, it's dangerous. Tell us more. A lot of people have been killed, Luke. A lot of people have been killed. Hit and drives. Uh, I mean, uh, you know, it's, it's horrible. It is getting better. And the police officers, some do, some not. I mean, one time... Legally here in Las Vegas, you have to be on the street. I, some of the police officers get off the street, go on the sidewalk. They don't even know. I swear, they don't even know their own damn laws. The cycling community and all the yeah, it's cool people. It's chill. I mean, uh, it's nice. It's cool. The sun, you know, it's not shining. Good biking weather. Also, great exercise. Great exercise. Why spend like $30 a month for a gym? get a bicycle stay in shape that way you know we always say it ride bikes more keep it safe keep it legal but i have noticed as well it is kind of dangerous on these streets people don't seem to move especially on the las vegas strip when you go on the las vegas yes you can have a bicycle on the las vegas strip but you're gonna have to be on the sidewalk and you know like han solo do the asteroids 
you know, going through the tourists, but there is no other way, Luke. There is no other way. Any other messages you want to give the cycling community? Anything we didn't address, Eric? Like, subscribe, and follow this man here because he's one of the few people doing it. And stay safe out there. And overall, ride bikes. More. I could not have said it better. I'm Luke for Ride Bikes More, and we I'm are Eric McBride, the BC Clater Company, coming at you. And we are out. Mm. My check. One, two, one, two. Sibilance. Sibilance.